Avery No Iron labels are great for identifying clothing, water bottles, school supplies, daycare or nursing home items, sporting gear, and more. The labels work with a variety of fabrics, including clothing and masks, and are durable enough to withstand multiple washer and dryer cycles. Let's walk through how to apply Avery No Iron labels for fabric, bottles, and more. For best results, permanent markers should be used to write on your label. We recommend using our Avery Marks A Lot permanent markers as these are fade resistant and dry quickly so they don't smear. When applying your labels, we recommend using these labels on smooth, non-textured surfaces as these labels are tested to withstand up to 20 washes. First, you will want to lay and flatten your fabric down on a hard, smooth surface. Then, take your label and apply it to the fabric. Make sure to use heavy pressure while pushing it down for about 10 to 30 seconds. This is important if you want the label to stay on when you place it in your washer and dryer. When it comes to washing and drying your garment, we have some additional tips to help extend the life of your label. First, you'll want to wait 24 hours after applying your label before washing the fabric. This is to ensure that the label is completely bonded to your fabric. You should also turn the garment inside out and wash in cold or warm water with a mild detergent. Do not use any fabric softener while washing, as this can weaken the strength of the adhesive and may cause peeling. If using a dryer, we recommend selecting a light or low heat setting. If you need to remove the label, we have a technique that you can try. However, it should be noted that these labels are designed with an aggressive, permanent adhesive so that it can withstand multiple laundry cycles. Even if you can remove the label, there may be residue remaining. You may be able to remove the label by placing the item of clothing in the freezer for a couple of hours. Then take the clothing out of the freezer and immediately try removing the label while it's still cold. The cold temperature will harden the adhesive and may make removal easier and more complete. If there's any adhesive residue remaining on clothing, scrape the surface with a butter knife while still cold. If you see residue on bottles, plastic, steel, or glass surfaces, try using one of the popular orange oil-based adhesive removers, but be sure to spot test this first to see if it removes color from the objects or leaves a stain. If you have additional questions, you can always contact our care team or visit avery.com help if you need additional help or more information. Thank you for using genuine Avery products.